Okay, so we're going to be looking at costume choices um, for different characters. It is a character analysis, so keep in mind that you need to show you really understand these characters. Um, so I like when using something like a PowerPoint just because it makes it a little bit easier um, to, to maneuver images. You could use PowerPoint, Google Slide, you could use Microsoft Word, you could use Publisher, anything that lets you put images and text. Um, I just don't like messing with the whole wrapping of the images on Microsoft Word. So costumes for a midsummer oopsie, summer nights dream. Make sure that you are always properly spelling a title. Make sure that you are italicizing it or underlining it and make sure that apostrophe is after the word night. You can put down your name. Whatever your name is. Okay. Oh, it's an alarm on my phone. Okay, so um, what you're going to do is you're going to have for each character, um, you are going to put their name. Um, I am going to go ahead and put, I think like this. We're going to do this guy. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and put Hermia or whatever it might be. I'm going to make this a little bit bigger. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Okay. Um, and I'm going to put the images here and my text over here. I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. So what you want to do is you really want to make sure that you're thinking about what are the personality character traits of Hermia? What kind of person is she? What sort of themes or symbolism can you convey through her wardrobe? So place her in a middle school just like yours and what should she be wearing? So I'm going to go ahead and have um, Hermia wear. You can see I prefer Hot Topic. You can do whatever show, uh, whatever store you want. Um, Hermia in this cute little dress that has the balloons from and the house from up, which I think kind of shows her romantic nature for sure. Um, so you can try doing the thing where you copy the image. I know some websites won't let you do that. Or in the event of, let's say, this version, I don't really want this girl's face on there. I just want the dress. Um, so if I just want the dress, one thing I can do is go on down the snipping tool. There we go. And I can take just the dress. So if I wanted just the skirt or just the bracelet the person's wearing, what have you, I could do that. I'm going to hold down control and press C, which just is copying that for me. And I'm going to go ahead and hold down control and press press V as in victory, and that is what's pasting it for me. So I have her little dress there, and I would need more than this, most likely. I want to go ahead and properly outfit her. Um, so I want to think about, okay, what what other cardigan would I want? What kind of shoes would I want? That sort of thing. And I'm going to load up all of those things on here, um, virtually her entire wardrobe. Um, then what I can do is I can say um, up. Skirts. Uh, up. Let me I underline that because the name of it. Up. Inspired skirts. And I can explain why I chose the skirt. I need to talk either about theme, a personality trait of the character, whatever. So, um, um, in the movie Up, the main character loves his wife so much that he continues her legacy and I would just write it blah 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 this relates to Hermia because and then I would go ahead and fill out why this relates to Hermia. So you're going to go ahead and be a little specific. Um, and then if I have like a cardigan here, a bracelet there, what have you. I can also then go and go into shapes. And I can make a little arrow go straight to her little skirt. So I can show the skirt we're talking about. Um, to change the color of the shape, so you can see the blue isn't very effective. I can go to format. And I think a nice medium black would work out well. So I'm going to go through there. I'm going to annotate. My next slide over um, might have somebody like um, 
let's go ahead. Let's let's take these socks. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and put in um, these socks for none other than Lysander, who I really really um, think is a is an upstanding young gent, um, and I think he's kind of like the good guy. So see, it was not letting me take it. Hold on, we're just gonna copy image. Go over here. I'm gonna paste the image. There we go. You see, I need to resize it very quickly. Okay, so for his, I would go and I would explain the reason why I'm do, giving him the Captain America is because Captain America, and I would maybe talk about how Captain America, you'll notice all of these are movie referential, Your, yours doesn't have to be, but I would talk about how Captain America is a really loyal person, and how that is where Lysander is, is very loyal to Hermia, um, and then I might, because I know what's going to happen in the play, I might might say something to the effect of he'll actually take off his socks during the play and that's also showing his um, disloyalty or something like that. So you're going to have a whole bunch of little items up and explain the characters. Make sure, make sure, make sure whatever you are selecting is appropriate. So while it doesn't necessarily have to be in dress code, the sayings should be appropriate. The comments shouldn't be appropriate. There's a lot of shirts out there that they're witty and they're funny and they use puns. But those puns are either sexual or something like that where it just it's not appropriate for a school project. So make sure that you are not um, doing that um, just because I, I, don't, I don't feel comfortable with that. And I don't think you should feel comfortable with doing that and submitting that for something for school. Um, so if anything that's suggesting um, profanity or anything that is suggesting um, something sexual, leave that stuff out. Um, that's not really the proper, um, this is not the proper venue. Then you're going to go ahead, you can save as PDF. Um, when I save it, I'm going to go right here, I can save it there. And you'll see when it pops up, it's going to be this lovely presentation. You'll, of course, will make it much more lovely and much more beautiful. Um, but it should be pretty, a pretty fun little thing for you to do if you choose to do this option.